start. So step, step one to set up the Stargate net bridge, you need to put it into its stand, and then start plugging in everything. So attach the ethernet cable so I can um, connect to the internet. Next, connect my USB base station so I can log the data from my nodes. A USB flash disk drive. And now give it some power. So the lights are coming on. So I guess I'll just wait for all the lights to come on. Make sure it's up and running. So step two, I am supposed to set up the base station and the sensor nodes by turning them on. Turn on these nodes. The lights are on. Looks like my net bridge is connecting. So step three, I'm supposed to open up an internet browser window and type in the URL that is on the bottom of my Stargate net bridge. So let me open up a browser. So the timer is going. So far, so good. I can type correctly. There we go. So I've opened up a Mo Explorer window in the internet. It's logged me into the site. Now I just need to type in the default login, which is listed here in my quick start guide. Need to wait a few more minutes for my net bridge to connect. And all the lights are on. And voila, I've opened up my Mo Explorer window. You can see here, you can see all my three nodes, two nodes and my base station. If so I click on network, I can see the links between the two nodes and the base station, and it looks like I can also get some charts and some data from the nodes. Click on the different screens. Make a new chart. Looks like I can just choose either any of the sensors, temperature, humidity. see the data that my network is collecting, so I guess you can actually do it. It took me four minutes to set that up, so Crossbow is right. You can set this up within a few minutes, and it wasn't very difficult for me at all.